Please, Your Honor, I've not put a more senior counsel. My name, I believe, has been put on record, for which I'm grateful to my colleagues and to the court. I have just a few things to say which have happened during my presence here. The rest will be said by my learned junior, Nini Sotieno. I want to just remind us of the obvious, that a court of law is a very serious forum for dispensing justice. And I want to agree with the prosecution that uh, this court has powers to reject judges. Once it is clear that what is before the court is an illegality, that alone is enough to make the court reject the judges. The court cannot be told, go on, you can throw us out later, but give us, give the illegality a little light because, as he says, the DPP did not do those things. It is the other team. The criminal justice system has the court on one hand. It has the prosecution where the DPP is where the DCI and everybody else, every other police investigator lies, and it has the defense. That is a, crim a criminal court. Accused, the team of the accused, which is the or suspect, which is the defense, the team of the prosecution, which has DPP and everybody else behind him, and the court. It's not enough for the DPP to try and exonerate himself. He is part of the illegality because they are part, he's part of that broad team. And I just want to remind the court also that the court was given copies of the orders of the High Court, actually of the firearms covered in these two orders. And once there are stop orders, you cannot arrest for purported lack of license when the withdrawal of the licenses is on hold by a superior court. You cannot? They cannot arrest. The police cannot arrest on firearm charges that have been whose dispute of a licensing has been stayed by the court. If they were able to say the charges before you relate to different firearms and different offenses, but you look at it, Smith and Wesson, the same thing here. It looks actually identical. So I'm asking your honor when you retreat, this is enough to make you throw out the charges, the whole chain of events. And I would have hoped the DPP, who is the advisor of the entire team, would have told them you can't touch this until we finalize in the High Court. The second issue I want to touch on is the fact that the search upon which these charges are found, are founded, because they say found. Found, you find when you search. Either the person or their property. The search was without a warrant, therefore illegal. As per the DCJ Mwilu case, her entire criminal charges merited and unmerited were thrown out just on the basis of lack of a search warrant. Is that case, that case, or that? The Mwilu case, the DCJ case. 
I do not have the citation of the, the internet is moving very slowly. By the time my colleagues finish to reply, we will give you the exact citation. But it is a case which acquired notoriety and uh, all the charges against the DCJ were thrown out on illegal search. That authority which has not, there was no appeal, is binding on you. They never went to trial. The court threw out the charges. Why would this court then be told, proceed, let him plead, even fix a hearing date, they bring evidence, and by the way, we have no obligation to bring any evidence. Only the prosecutor can bring evidence. So why would the court proceed to take its valuable time in entertaining these charges and that's why I opened by saying the court is not an entertainment forum it's a serious forum you're being asked to proceed on charges which we all know go nowhere because of what is going on finally justice must be dispensed expeditiously so if the court agrees with us that indeed there was no warrant, indeed there are prohibitory orders from the High Court saying halt anything to do with gun licenses until the cases are dispensed with, then we know that what is before you is an illegality in disobedience of court orders. And I would like your honor to remember the environment we are acting in, where the courts of law are giving orders for police to do certain things and they are disobeyed with impunity. It's public knowledge. A matter the court can take a notoriety, can take judicial notice of. They are told, don't use tear gas on the people they use. Don't obstruct demonstrations, they obstruct. Do not use like bullets, they still kill. Now they have brought 